Hi, welcome back to my vlog, Peace of Life. And if you are new here, hello. And if you're coming back, thank you so much. Thank you so, so much for all. Um, I've had some new subscribers. And thank you for anybody who's been coming back consistently and seeing me. I appreciate it so much. I know you guys have so many choices and I really appreciate it. So I wanted to say that first. Um, and then I wanted to say really quickly kind of what I'm doing here. So yes, I know it seems like I do a lot of Zara hauls, but I do wear a lot of the same things. So again, I know I talked about it before. I know people are like, Zara's fast fashion, but I think if you're getting classic pieces, it really isn't. Like I have things from three, four years ago, that navy blazer I talk about all the time. I've probably had it for like four years. So I think a lot of the pieces I get are really classic pieces that you can make um, more chic and cool or more of a street vibe, just like the way you style it. So maybe you're adding a new handbag, new shoes, or wearing it a different way. And that's where I come in. I want you to be able to get an item and I wanna show you like maybe four ways to wear it so that when you get it at home, you don't feel like you're always wearing it the same way which I know in the past, like I've had outfits that I love and I wear it the exact same way. So say you wear this out this outfit that's like so lit and you're getting all these compliments and you are just feeling yourself. But then every time you wear it, it feels like, I've had someone say this to me before. It's like, you wear that outfit the same way all the time. It's starting to look like a uniform. Yes, that's what good friends do. They tell you the truth and it's true. It's like, I know you love the outfit, but if you wear it the same way all the time, you just need to be able to break it up. So hopefully that's what I can do. So what I wanna talk about, you saw on the title, is about these viral cargo pants. So these pants have been everywhere and they are so hard to get your hands on. Like literally it would come in and I would try to get it and then it would be out. Like someone got to the information quicker than I did. Um, these are very popular too is okay first of all I'm having a love affair with navy I think we all are it's like kind of like navy and silver are having their moment let's give it to them perfect for spring um, but these are really popular and I think a lot of it has to do is that they're very comparable to the Attico jeans which are like over a thousand dollars and these are under a hundred and I love the silver hardware. I love all the pockets. Um, the only thing different, it's funny, is the Attico has a little uh, strap here where you can kind of like close it in, close it to your ankle. And I know I told you guys before that um, Zara, so most of everything you see on Zara is something that has been on the runway that has been by another designer. So say these are so close to Attico, the only thing is, I think I told you before, is that they have to have seven points of difference. So it could be where the pockets are placed, the fact that it doesn't have a way to like pull in the ankle. So those little things are the things that you can kind of replicate it or get inspired by. So what Zara does, but it can't be exactly the same. There will be like seven differences that if you held them next to each other, you'd be able to tell if you had an eye for it or if the designer were to see it. So these are the pants. I finally got them, or the cargos. So I'm going to show you them up close. They do kind of go into a wider leg. Now here is the little caveat, is that I am tall. So these, I would like these a little bit longer. I love like if you're wearing like an Adidas Samba or a New Balance, and when the pant is wide and it kind of just like has a little bit of a bend in the pants. So um, they kind of like are a little bit longer. But, so if you're more petite or just, um, I, it's like I'm tall, so I'm probably above average height, so they're going to be a little bit shorter on me. I'm used to that. Um, but the thing is, I did notice is that there is a lot of hem in here. So if I took this hem out, they would be exactly the right length for me. And I think it'd be kind of cool having a raw edge hem. So when I get into this, I wanted just to show you them up close before I put them on. So that way you get a better look of them, just kind of seeing. And I am wearing a Zara shirt that is actually another kind of viral shirt that's been really big. Um, it came in white and gray. I also have a love affair with gray that will never leave. I love gray. I don't know how many gray hoodies, sweaters, t-shirts. I mean, I think we all kind of do. Um, so I'm gonna pop these on really quickly and then we're gonna get into it. And I'm just gonna show you again, when you come to my video, I'm not gonna show you a ton of new stuff. Like I know a lot of people do, a lot of vlogs do where they have 10 new items. To be honest, I ain't about that life. I tip, I can't afford, I don't never wanna say I can't afford things cause you don't wanna put that into the universe, but I just don't wanna, I don't go into Zara and drop like 
money and get like 10 new items. I prefer just to add a couple items maybe each season or just show you how you can wear it different ways because I 100% if you get your hands on these or any cargo um, just to show you how to style it you probably have most of these items in your closet already so you don't really need to like go out and get the same piece so this is new from Zara I do like it I like this layered look but again you probably have a great t-shirt in your closet already so that's kind of what I'm doing so when I when you come on here just know that I'm gonna really try to focus around one item and then I'm gonna focus around how to style it and I think these are really cool because these are like viral cargo like literally like in and out in and out you cannot find these and I think right now they're not even in so like you know sometimes they'll like if you keep refreshing you can find it I don't know how I got them but I did so I'm gonna pop them on and then we're gonna do what we always do we're gonna talk about how to style them so let me pop these on and then we'll get into it okay I am back I hope the lighting's okay so this is a shirt um so the shirt is like layered like this is attached and it's funny because it's still going strong it came out you know, I really saw that little arm candy there, but it came out a while ago, but it's like, like but you look like a who, what, where. They're showing this t-shirt a lot. I love it. I think it's a great um, transitional piece because you can take it from like spring into summer because it's very like lightweight. I think you could wear it into the office with a blazer. So um, here's the pants. Okay, so they are a little big. I kind of wish I would have went down a size. But these are so cool, you guys. Look at these. I mean, these are it. Like, I love the dark navy. Again, like, love affair, dark navy. Um, I'm going to pan down. I don't have shoes on yet. Is that going to bother you guys? I don't know. But I am loving my New Balance. I know. I'm having a thing with New Balance. There's a pair I really want. They're like the 530. I've been wearing these a lot. Like, so this sock here um, just says Zoe LA. So I kind of like wearing like a chunk, like a sock like this that's a little bit thicker. And then I would pair it with the pant. I feel like you guys are gonna wanna see these on. I have a hunch, so like I would. So I'm not gonna put the shoe on, but I'm gonna show you like how cute these are. So let's pan down. Can you see? And then see like with the gray, how cute that is. Oh, so good. And so if I go down a little bit more, you can see they're, let me see, oh, this chair. I know you guys probably hate this chair. I don't know why I always have it here, but just I do. Okay, so see, they actually are long enough because you know what it is? Because they're loose, they kind of come down more, but that's the gray. I love that. I'm gonna pop you back up again. Okay, so look how cute that is. So this is the outfit already. You're ready to go. You're just wearing your New Balance. Again, I like it with a sock kind of like that. This is a fit. I know it's a little chilly outside. Even in California, baby, the sun does not always shine. Okay, so the bag I would carry is this. I love this bag. I carry it more now than I did when I got it. Again, I told you guys I thought it was going to be a purchase that I may regret because, you know, am I going to wear it that much? And I wear it all the time. I love it. I mean, it just it kind of makes the fit. Again, you can do it as a clutch. But I just think like if you were out and you just have your like little New Balance on, you're ready to go, right? Okay, so what are we wearing over this? And I can't see my face. That's okay. Um, I'll pop that up. So I wanted to show you this. So this is another um, bomber jacket. So this was another one that was, um, what you would call it, viral. So another viral, let me pop you guys up a little. Another viral bomber jacket that was really big. So this one doesn't have the um, stripes that I showed you that was a little bit more like varsity. Um, guys, sorry. Can you see me? Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. The other one, I just realized that that one was, um, uh, I'll say, what's the word I'm looking for? Inspiration by Celine. So the other one that I wore that had the white um, little lines on it, like the varsity look, which is also gone viral. You cannot find that one. That is a Celine inspiration. So cool. So I noticed a little dip, few differences, but again, this is another one that was viral. Did, I don't know how I got it, but I did. 
Um, but look how cute this fit is. Bam, you guys. You are my people. You guys get my style and you get me and I love you. And again, I'm really trying to grow my channel. So please, if you like my video, take a moment to subscribe, um, hit the like button or share it because I, you know, I have a small following, but I love it because this is like a passion. I love fashion. I mean, I just, I just do it because I love it and I love putting looks together. And I think it's really important if you take an item home that you know how to wear it and you feel confident that you're going to wear it more than one way. So look how chic this looks. I mean, hello. You could wear this into the office. All you have to do is change out your shoe. So this would be really cute with like a white heel, which I think I've shown you guys before. Um, but look how cute that looks. Again, just with the, my shoes getting caught up, just with the New Balance. And then you could do the white bag. I love that. Also, if you kind of wanted to dress this look up, you could do a little sandal, which would be so cute. That's not a sandal. It's a little kit inside, but look at it, it's silver. How dope would this be? So say you're going out after work, you can just pop these on. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see down that far. Sorry guys. But see, just the little, is this throwing you guys off the thing? But you get the gyp. So see if I go down a little bit longer, it's gonna work for me. So um, if I take the hem out, but I'm gonna push you guys back up. You know we keep it real here. No fancy little cutaways, but see how cute these are. And these are from J. Crew. And again, love the silver. Um, the other bag, so we know I this is like my go-to. Also, I have not been carrying this as much, and I love it. And I love the silver hardware. Again, this is the Prada. I want to say it was a 2006 edition, and I love just carrying it by the handle. Again. I'm not a big crossbody person at this moment, but I do love this one because if you want to go hands-free, I mean, this is it, people. I mean, look at this. You look cute and chic, boom, 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 effortless. This jacket is it. Like, even if you button it all the way up, I mean, you guys, you need it. If you can find it, I think you guys can. Putting out the good juju. Also, never underestimate the power of a nice, clean, basic tennis shoe or sneaker you don't always have to do something like nike new balance sambas and these have gray in the back so they're really cute and it's very clean and chic so that would be another vibe just with this look here just to do a clean white sneaker love that okay so this is a fit and then um i just i don't know i'm still only going to take it off look how cute this is and then the shirt again, this is Zara. It came in black and, not sorry, it came in white also. I'm gonna grab the heels for UK because I heard someone say they like it when we, um, or people in general, when they show a shoe too. And I understand that because not everybody, some people want like that help, you know, and putting things together and I love that because that's what I love to do. I love style. Put this down. So these are my white heels. These are from um, J. Crew, and I love them because they are inspired by Celine. Um, Celine does a shoe just like that. So you know what, you guys? I hope you're not getting annoyed going up and down. But okay, so don't sleep on J. Crew. They make such great shoes. You'd be really surprised. So if I wanted to kind of dress this look up, again, same t-shirt, same uh, cargo pants. Then my blazer, which you guys know I have forever. I never want you to guys to feel like you have to come here and buy new stuff. I literally have had this blazer probably for four years. You guys, can we just take, can we just take a moment? Just a moment. I just got like butterflies in my stomach. Look how cute this outfit looks. You guys, this could be the one. She could be the winner. Look at this bag. Let's go down. Look at white heel. I mean, this is it, you guys. I'm obsessed. I mean, I feel like I'm like, it's like the cool girl, but you're like not trying that hard. I like my hair tucked into my blazer. I love the heel. Again, just the white heel. And this is like Celine did. They did like a, a deep kind of V. It's pointy. I love that there's like a little kitten heel because I am tall. 
So, do, so the white, and then also, like I said, these silver. Silver's gonna be really big for spring. So again, this with the blazer would be really cute too. Um, again, as it gets warmer, I'm just gonna bring you guys down a little. I'm barefoot, but just to kind of, you get the gist. Little sandals, so that's very cute. Okay, this is such a cute vibe. I love it. Okay, so it has literally been cold everywhere. Like even in California, LA, I mean, what the hell's going on? I don't know, people. I feel like we should be a little concerned, but so if it's a little chilly, I would leave the gray on and then I would do like a sweater and you could wear the sweater underneath the blazer, but you know, I'm, is this the hood? No, you know, I'm a sucker for layering again, sucker for gray, but look how cute this is. Boom, shakalaka. So you have your gray, you have your little thing. And it's just to keep warm, you can take things off. And this is something I think you could wear into the office. With these pants, you could do a boot. Again, if you do a boot, like a pointy boot, it would be really hot, high. Um, you could do the white heel, it would be very cute. And then also I brought out my good old Chanel bag. And you guys, I literally, I think I told you, you had this for like 10 years. I love this too. So this would be a really cute look too under the shoulder you could put it on the shoulder again shoulder i guess right now everything's going into bigger bags but i think this is a good size bag compared to everything else but again just on the shoulder look how chic that looks and again like i said a lot of people i know don't want to do like a new balance i get it it's a dad sneaker it's a lot like this would be my vibe even with the bag the cargoes the shirt but if you want to do something clean, I think that we've really forgotten about just a nice, clean, basic white sneaker. So I would do that. Okay. And then also for my girls and guys, loafer. Don't forget about this, a thick loafer. You could do it with a white sock or even like a dark navy sock, pinstripe. How cute would that look too with the navy? And then again, you could pull out any of the bags I showed you. I kind of bring out the same bags because I love, but I love this Bottega bag. Again, vintage. So don't sleep on that. But look how cute that would look too with the loafer. So you're doing all these looks like with the same kind of base. And then I'm going to try to take this off and put something new on because I think we need a new top. I will be right. Okay, I'm obsessed with this shirt. I talked to you guys about this before when I did my other video with that viral bomber jacket. And I was telling you how the model had on a white long sleeve shirt. I love this. Again, so this is it. I got it. I couldn't get it at first. It kept on coming in and out of stock. But look how cute that looks. Again, just let me pan it down so you see. With the cargo pants, look how cute that is with the crop top. Again, I just left the little silver heels on. These are so darn cute. Little heel, again, I would throw it on with the loafer. I think that's a really cool vibe. And then you could even do, like, these are things like you could just like, again, literally throw into your suitcase and you could just like wear these different pieces. I mean, gray and silver. And like, look how cute that looks too, you guys. Boom. I'm winning. I am winning in life right now. Look how cute these outfits look. Just easy breezy. Again, this would be so cute with the white heels if you're going out to meet friends. So say you could throw the blazer on. Also the bomber. Again, another viral bomber. This looks really cute with the shirt. Look how cute that looks. Boom. And then boom shakalaka with the white look how cute that is and then again with the white little heel which i don't know where i put them but i showed them to you the white pointy heel or like a high pointy boot would be really cute on your arm under the pocket i love this look here this is so cute and again you could wear this into the office and you're ready to go and then i like the look like i said i, I know i told you guys this before but I like being able to wear things that you wear into the office, but you don't feel like you have to go home and change. So maybe work, you might button it all the way up. That looks more classic with the bomber. And then you could have like a nice heel on or a boot and then maybe 
when you go out, you can change your shoe or change it into a trainer. Like I would even throw this vibe on with my new balance. This is such a cute look. Another bag I brought out is this one here. So if you want to make it more casual, you could do something like this. Again, this is just black. And don't be afraid to mix black with navy. Again, just throw it on. And then also, dude, I finally got my hands on the Birkenstocks. I didn't even want to actually wear them. Do you know how hard it was to get these suckers? I mean, blood, sweat, and tears. Not really, but you know what I'm saying. It took forever. They were out of stock. But I think these are going to be really cute. See that? With that. Oh, you know what bad I would, there's another bag. Oh, the, um, I do like this look though. Look how cute this looks. If you just had your new balance on, show a little bit more of my stomach than I went to, but you get the deal. But with the, um, Birkenstocks, I think they'd be cute with like a cream bag. I mean, navy is just like it. I mean, navy is like the new black right now. Look at that. Boom. And then again, the Burks. So if you want them, they are out there. I got these from J. Crew. Look at the J. Crew shoe. So this would be really a cute look. Again, just easy breezy. And then I want to show you the blazer too, because again, oh, you guys, I have something else to show you. I got this too. Look at this bomber. I'm not going to talk about it too much because it's going to be in my next video. So I'm going to show you different ways to wear it, but look how sick this is. And I love it with the navy. It just like, okay, I just got really excited. Look at that. Just easy breezy. The cream is going to be cute. It's kind of like a bone color, but we will talk about that later because you're going to come back and see me. Again, please take a moment to subscribe. Hit the like button. Again, I'm always going to show you cool ways to wear things and you're not going to have to buy a ton of stuff. So I'm going to show you something else. Okay, I got this from Topshop. Literally, you guys, should I pan you up? I just think I have my setting on a weird... I didn't put my thing on a book or anything, so I think that's why it's feeling like it's a little low. But look how cute this is. This is navy and it's from Topshop. I got this probably three years ago and I'm so glad I kept it. But look how cute it looks. So you can do all navy, like kind of like a monochromatic look. And this would look so cute. There's a pair of tennis shoes I, I'm like wanting, like glesting over. I know I'm late to the game, but they're the 530 New Balance and they're silver and navy. Need I say more? But look how cute this looks with that. And then again, my first, I told you guys this, my first puffer jacket in black. I had one in green, but look at this. This would be really cute. So again, you're swearing all navy underneath. Just grab a bag. Even like more, this might be kind of cute like for a more casual vibe. If you're just going out shopping. I love that. I hope you can tell that this is navy. And then I would probably wear my New Balance because I don't know what it is. I know I'm late to the game on the New Balance too, but I'm like obsessed with these right now. I like want to wear them every day, but I love this look. It's just so easy. Again, I love the all navy. This, and it's so warm and comfortable. I hope they, I don't know if they still have it, but Look how cute this is. Just easy, breezy, you're ready to go. It would be really cute with that bomber I showed you. I'm not gonna tell you where I got this one from because you're gonna come back and see me, right? You are coming back to see me, so we're gonna talk more about this bomber. And then, I think we're pretty good. I think I showed you some cool outfits. Um, I'm gonna bring you back over here. Okay, so, all right, so I think we're good. Um, I think those are all the outfits. Again, we'll talk about this later because it's so good and you're going to want to know about it. But what I wanted to show you guys too is um, this lip gloss. You guys have to get this. Do not sleep on this. So this lip gloss is Rihanna's new lip gloss, and she did it for the Super Bowl. The color is called Riri. It's been so hard to find. You can't really see my face. That might be a good thing. 
but it's been so hard to find. It's called Riri and it came in this really cute package, but she has it back on, um, on the website again, on her website. Sephora was completely sold out. I don't have any liner on my lips, but look how cute this is. It is like the perfect, like pink. Can you see that? Like the perfect pinkish color. I'm obsessed with it. It kind of has like some blues in it, but it's called, again, it's called Riri. So get that, you need that. Again, cargo pants. I love all the ways I showed you to wear it. I'm kind of obsessed with the bomber jacket with it. So again, both of the items are really viral pieces. Um, you guys are good. I mean, like, it's so crazy. Like, people know the right pieces to get. It's like they are in and out and they're quick. So it's, the thing with Zara, if you're like kind of hemming and hawing on it, just get it and you can always return it. You have 30 days. But if you wait, it'll be gone. And then I'm just wearing silver hoops. Again, Love Affair with silver. I got a little silver dome ring. This lip gloss is everything. I am utterly obsessed with it. Again, it's called Riri, and I love this little cute box that comes in. Like I said, I didn't put any lip liner with it. I did a little bit darker eyeshadow on my eyes. Um, My hair is getting way too long. Okay. Enough. Zip. Okay, Kathy's coming out, which means chatty Kathy. But quickly, I want to say, my video is called Peace of Life. Please do something peaceful for yourself. You deserve it. Do something you love. You're never too young or too old to live your dream. Life is short. We're all just visitors here. Please do something for yourself. Don't worry about what other people say or think or do. It's all about you. Do you. Be you. Be your most authentic self. Live your life. Do something fun. Get in the car. Sing your lungs out. Go buy a coffee or make a coffee at home and go for a drive. You know, call someone you haven't talked to for a while. Do something that you want to do that makes you happy. And just, again, don't let anybody tell you who you are. Don't let anybody tell you that you don't own the space or own space when you walk into a room. And if something doesn't feel right, let people know you don't need to be aggressive, but you can be assertive and you, you know, people should be respectful. And it's like things that I'm learning as I get older that I wish I knew when I was younger, but it's okay to speak up for yourself. You know, as long as you do it in a respectful way. And it's also time to say it's time to let go. And you don't own oh, people explanations, you know, like you have to do you and do what's best for you. Trust me, it's not easy, but you'll get there. But again, I don't know. Why am I going to stand up? I, I don't know. But please, again, like I said, if you, I, if you even got this far, excuse me, please subscribe or hit the like button. I'm so excited. I hope you like how I'm kind of doing this with viral pieces. Oh, excuse me. And showing you different ways to wear it. That's what I feel like I really love to do. I love styling. That's what I do. It's my jam. So I will see you guys soon. Bye.